Imagine a tiny lonely traveler, Voyager 2. Launched in 1977, it was built not of flesh and blood, but of wires and hope. Its mission, explore the giant planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. Voyager 2 gave us our first close-up views of these distant worlds, revealing storms, rings and moons. After Neptune in 1989, it kept going, heading for the edge of the sun's influence, the heliopause. In 2018, it crossed into interstellar space, only the second human-made object to do so. Now, July 1st, 2025, it's over 13 billion miles away, a silent ambassador in the cosmic dark. That distance is almost unimaginable, tens of thousands of years by jet. Voyager 2 is our most distant, active messenger, carrying a golden record, a message in a bottle for any who might find it. Built with 1970s technology, it survived nearly half a century in space. It's endured extremes, cosmic rays and the unknown, lasting longer than anyone dreamed. Voyager 2 is more than a machine. It's our eyes and ears in a place we cannot go. It continues to send back whispers from the void, telling us about the universe beyond our home. It's a symbol of our hope, our intelligence, and our desire to connect with the cosmos. The spacecraft is a testament to what we can achieve when we aim for the stars. Its golden record is a greeting to the universe, a snapshot of Earth and humanity. Voyager 2's journey is a triumph of curiosity and engineering. It reminds us how far we've come and how much more there is to discover. Even now, it drifts onward, a tiny spark of human wonder in the endless night. Its story is still being written, far beyond the reach of our world. Communicating with Voyager 2 is like whispering across a vast cosmic canyon. Its signals travel at light speed, yet take over 19 hours to reach us, and another 19 for our reply. Every message is a two-day round trip, a conversation stretched thin by distance. The spacecraft's transmitter is weaker than a refrigerator bowl. By the time its signal reaches Earth, it's measured in quintillionths of a watt, barely a murmur. NASA's deep space network must listen for this faintest whisper using massive radio antennas. If something goes wrong, engineers can't fix it instantly. They diagnose, send commands, and wait, sometimes days for a response. Each bit of data is precious, a hard-won gift from the edge of the solar system. The team at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory are cosmic mechanics, performing remote surgery from billions of miles away. Voyager 2's continued contact is a technological marvel, a testament to human ingenuity. We're still talking to a machine launched when disco ruled and the internet was a dream. Every message is a victory over distance and time. The faintness of the signal makes every bit of data more valuable. Voyager 2's whispers are our only direct link to the unknown beyond our solar system. Each transmission is a reminder. We are explorers, listening for echoes from the stars. Voyager 2's greatest enemy isn't distance, it's time. Its power comes from a nuclear battery, slowly fading as plutonium decays. Each year it loses about 4 watts, forcing tough choices. NASA has begun shutting down science instruments to conserve energy. Turning off these tools is like asking an explorer to close their eyes, but it's necessary for survival. In March 2024, the Low Energy Charge Particle Instrument, LECP, was powered down. A bittersweet milestone. The LECP had measured ions and electrons for decades, helping us understand the edge of the heliosphere. Its shutdown was a calculated move to save precious watts, keeping Voyager 2 alive a little longer. More instruments will be turned off in the coming years, aiming to keep at least one running into the 2030S. If Voyager 2 survives until August 2027, it will mark 50 years in space. Each day it functions is a bonus, a final gift of knowledge from the void. The team is fighting a slow battle against inevitable decay, squeezing every last drop of science from this resilient explorer. The mission's end will come not with a crash, but with a gradual fading of power and silence. Until then, every bit of data is a triumph over time itself. Voyager 2's endurance is a testament to human persistence and ingenuity. Voyager 2's story is as much about engineering as exploration. Built in an era of slide rules, it has survived nearly 50 years in the harshest environment imaginable. Its longevity has surpassed all expectations, a tribute to the skill and foresight of its creators. The LECP instrument before shutdown outlasted its design by 17 times, its tiny motor completing over 8 million steps. The Voyager team has become expert at solving problems from billions of miles away. Once a mistaken command tilted the antenna off Earth, engineers used the deep space network to show the correction across the void. The signal returned, a problem fixed from across the solar system. With aging hardware and dwindling power, the team rewrites the rules, finding new ways to keep the mission alive. Every command sent, every bit of data received, is a victory. Voyager 2's endurance is not just hardware, 
It's the persistence of brilliant minds refusing to let the mission end. Each challenge overcome is a triumph of human ingenuity. The spacecraft's survival is a legacy of engineering miracles at the edge of space. The LECP shutdown in March 2024 was supposed to be the end. The team mourned the loss, but focused on the remaining instruments. Then something strange happened. A faint, ghostly signal appeared in the data. It was a whisper from the supposedly silent LECP. Was it a glitch, a random burst, or something more? The team began a careful analysis, cross-referencing signals and ruling out mundane explanations. This was cosmic detective work unfolding over weeks. The surprising signal was a reminder. Space is full of surprises. Even after decades, Voyager 2 could still astonish us. The shutdown was meant to be final, but the universe had other plans. A new chapter had begun, a ghostly echo from an instrument that refused to go quietly. The hidden transmission wasn't a message, but a subtle pattern in the noise, a faint anomaly in the data. Months of analysis revealed the truth. The LECP wasn't completely dead. A trickle of power, likely from a shared bus, kept part of its sensors barely alive. It couldn't rotate or perform complex measurements, but it could register the most powerful cosmic ray impacts. Each spike was a record of extreme events in the interstellar medium. The LECP, in its near-death state, had become a passive detector for the galaxy's most energetic particles. This accidental discovery provided a new perspective on deep space. The universe had repurposed the instrument, turning a shutdown into an opportunity. Deciphering the signal required deep understanding and careful filtering. Voyager 2 had given us a bonus round of science, a secret whispered from the void. The hidden transmission revealed both the nature of deep space and the resilience of human technology. Even in silence, Voyager 2 found a way to speak. In interstellar space, every bit of data is precious. Voyager 2 and its twin are our only probes in this unexplored realm. Their data is our only direct measurement of the galaxy's depths. The faint spikes from the LECP might seem insignificant, but they reveal the universe's most violent processes. By studying them, scientists learn about cosmic rays, supernovae, and the structure of interstellar magnetic fields. This information is vital for planning future missions, mapping radiation, preparing for the unknown. Every bit of data helps pave the way for the next generation of explorers. The Voyager mission isn't just about the past, it's about the future. Each day could bring a new interstellar revelation. The value of a single bit from 13 billion miles away is immense. It's knowledge we could get no other way. Voyager 2's data is a testament to our curiosity and drive to explore. Every signal is a step toward understanding our place in the universe. Voyager 2's legacy is etched in space and time. It changed our view of the solar system, sending back iconic images and rewriting textbooks. Now it provides groundbreaking data from the edge of the sun's influence. But its legacy goes beyond science. It's a symbol of human achievement and collaboration. Generations of engineers and scientists have kept it alive, bridging past and future. The golden record it carries is a greeting to the cosmos, a snapshot of Earth in 1977. The act of creating it was a profound exercise in self-reflection. Voyager 2 inspires us to look up, to wonder, and to cherish our fragile world. The famous pale blue dot image reminds us of our place in the universe. Its journey encourages humility and responsibility for our home. Voyager 2's legacy is a call to keep exploring and learning. It's a reminder that we share a beautiful, precious world. Its story is a beacon for all who dream of the stars. Voyager 2's journey isn't over. Even after it falls silent, it will drift through the galaxy for millions of years, a time capsule of humanity. It's a testament to a species that reached for the stars. The dream of Voyager is the dream of immortality, a hope that some part of us endures. Its success inspires new missions, new discoveries, and new dreams. The spirit of Voyager lives on in every probe we launch. Its persistence is a model for all future exploration. The path to the stars is long and difficult, but dedication and ingenuity can overcome any challenge. The story of Voyager 2's hidden transmission is both an ending and a beginning. It shows that discovery can come from the most unexpected places. Voyager 2's journey is our journey, a collective quest to understand the cosmos. As we dream of the stars, we follow in its wake, our silent messenger in the great ocean of space. The universe is waiting, and Voyager 2 reminds us to keep listening for its whispers.